In the heart of a bustling mining site, a monumental structure stands tall, a tailings dam. These dams, though often overlooked, play an integral role in the mining process, acting as the final resting place for the waste materials, or tailings, left over after the extraction of valuable minerals. The formation of a tailings dam is a complex process that begins with the excavation of the ground. Here, the earth is dug up, and the valuable minerals are separated from the less valuable soil and rock. This process, known as crushing, breaks down the material into smaller, more manageable pieces. The next step is grinding, where these small pieces are further reduced in size to liberate the valuable minerals. This process not only makes the extraction of these minerals easier, but also aids in the transportation of the tailings later on. The ground material then goes through a process of concentration and separation. This is where the valuable minerals are separated from the waste material. The waste material, now referred to as tailings, is mixed with water to create a slurry, which is then transported to the tailings dam. Once at the dam, the tailings undergo a process of thickening. This is where the water is separated from the solids, reducing the volume of the tailings and making them easier to manage. The tailings are then transported and deposited into the dam, marking the end of their journey. But not all tailings end up in a dam. Some are stored in what's known as a tailing storage facility, or TSF. Unlike a dam, a TSF is designed to store tailings in a dry state, reducing the risk of dam failure and the associated environmental impact. Water management is a crucial aspect of TSFs, ensuring that the tailings remain stable and safe. Safety is a paramount concern when it comes to tailings, dams, and TSFs. Measures are taken to ensure public safety, protect the environment, and maintain the stability of these structures. These measures include regular inspections, monitoring and maintenance, as well as emergency response planning. When designing a TSF, several factors are taken into account. This includes a thorough site analysis, considering factors such as earthquake resistance and storage capacity. The rate at which tailings are deposited into the facility is also considered, as is the life cycle of the mine. In conclusion, tailings, dams, and TSFs are more than just waste storage facilities. They are complex structures that require careful planning, design, and management. They play a vital role in the mining process, and their importance cannot be overstated.